Oh my god. What? You're already here, guys? Well, uh, I thought I was taking, you know, a little nap, having my beer just after work, but I think it looks like I'm gonna have to make you a short video review or something like that, so the good thing is I know what I'm gonna talk about, and this is that you probably have seen uh, my former video about the Odin from Felkniven a small little toothpick that is a uh, convex edge and so on so you may see if you want the video review about that but now what's new is that I've received the new sheath sorry you don't see my face but <coughs> the new sheath um, I'm gonna show you the first and the former version of the sheath, which is this one. A very good sheath. It has some drawbacks, as I've said. Um, sometimes it's a bit hard to put it back inside the sheath, uh, the, the knife back inside, but it has this wonderful logo that I really dig a lot. The belt loop was too wide, in my opinion. I would have uh, preferred something flatter like so so that uh, it sticks some in the blade uh, in the belt and also so that you can maybe put it on your belt without removing it and and so on now the last thing I did not like was that because now this is stiff but if it wears and got you know a bit uh, more supple here you see it's it's well in place but if it moves, uh, the leather got a bit used and soft. This might happen. And this exposed the blade and this is this could be really dangerous because when you're walking you have your arms like so and you can easily hurt yourself. And this is something you really don't want in a uh, survival situation or just when you are in the outdoors uh, doing what you like to do there. Uh, what we all like to do there. So I've ordered the new sheath. Um, I'm lucky they did have one, uh, one of them. And I'm just gonna go through the main differences that you can find. Uh, I don't have my tripod right here, so I'm gonna hold it with my hand and try to show you all that. Sorry for the mess. Didn't have time to uh, clean everything before the review. I'm just back home as I've said and this is not only for the video that I, I am suited up, I'm just coming from the court for a case. So here you see the two sheath. I'm gonna remove the knife. So first thing they did change a new design is that you have you don't have a handle strap like on this one you have a strap that goes over the quilt and that holds the knife right in place so you don't have the knife that the blade that can be exposed so you won't hurt yourself now they've added a clever thing uh, maybe a bit inspired by our good friend Paul Scheider uh, if the camera will focus it could be a great thing but it does not want to so here you see that small elastic this is for one reason when you open the, the strap it goes out of the way of the um, the, the, the the blade uh, I still prefer what Paul Scheider does with his uh, patented system but it's better than nothing um, <clears throat> other thing you may see you have here two rows of stitches here you have one uh, here it's more exposed than here and well the logo is not that nice sadly but the sheath itself is better built if you can see the difference uh, of thickness in the two sheath 
here it's a bit different uh, nothing uh, really huge like uh, one one and a half centi uh, millimeters mm, maximum I'd say they also changed <coughs> sorry for the shaky camera um, they have added a flat loop which is a great thing too uh, this is what I would have liked if I could uh, if they did ask my opinion about that and here what is it looks like a frog oh my god I must be really tired <clears throat> to see stuff like that here you have the possibility to open the belt loop and put your knife inside so this is really clever and the reason why this is clever too is that when uh, if for any reason the belt opens the, the belt loop opens it still remains uh, blocked between the sheath and um, the belt and your body sorry so here you have the belt and here you have your body this won't come loose quite easily because it it works like um, like a hook or something like that if they did do that on this kind of loop the loop will open and the sheath will easily fall and now last thing that is uh, pretty amazing uh, well <laughs> pretty amazing is it's maybe a, a too strong word but they did add um, a small piece of leather here that allows you to to attach the knife around your leg they did put a small leather uh, leather a um, piece of string rope cord but uh, I love leather um, this is something I would not put on a survival blade uh, obviously I will prefer uh, to use I'd rather use paracord of course so I'm gonna see if paracord may go uh, through those uh, excuse me for the focus may work with those small holes instead of that nice leather uh, string and I'm gonna put that string around my neck on a necklace or something like that so um, this is pretty much what I wanted to show you the the most important differences between those two sheath here I put them side by side so that you can see hope the camera is not too shaky I don't have my tripod as I've said so here I won't add steels at the end just try not to move too much so that I can still talk over the video and try not to annoy you <laughs> so very nice sheath very nice um, evolution on the new one I would have preferred a brown leather sheath because of the brown handle you have on the this the northern light series but anyway it's a very nice sheath and it works well um, they've added the modification I would have uh, proposed to to the, the brand Felkneven brand so that's pretty much all and now um, I'm just gonna say you bye bye and now I'm gonna take my nap and have my beer just first because I'm really thirsty and it's uh, well you have pretty high temperatures uh, in the USA or um, there <laughs> I don't know where you're from but in Switzerland we are not used to have 30 degrees Celsius uh, temperatures and I'm not dying but I'm pretty much uh, suffering from almost a heat strike so I'm gonna throw every of my survival knowledge um, to the toilet for a moment and have just a little beer and not to you know get water inside my body just to have some uh, cool th cool things and stuff <coughs> and 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 finish the week quietly so guys uh, thanks for watching. If you have any questions about my uh, two sheath, you can ask. Uh, don't worry, I won't bite you. And guys, thanks for watching. Cheers, bye bye.